Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. The babies are out. Let's go let the chickens out. Looks like a beautiful day today. Sure does. Uh huh. Girls! Oh, girls! <laughs> Good morning, girls! How's everyone today? Oh, happy Friday, girls! Happy Friday! Wow, just what I need! Look at the eggs this morning! Happy Friday, everyone! How's it going? Fresh radishes out of the garden. Not that many, but... How about some lettuce, man? You know, I can probably cut your whole head of uh, Oh, yeah. I want some lettuce. You want a leaf, too? Yeah, whatever you got. Yeah, but Set you need quite a bit. Yeah, that's okay. I'll clean it up and have it there ready to use when we... Need a knife. Did you say good morning, honey? Oh, I forgot. I was being ignorant, people. Showing your radishes. Good morning. I don't like showing my radishes this early in the morning. <laughs> we got some bacon we're going to put on. You already got sunflowers growing. Oh, I wanted to ask you. You know the ones I got growing here? Couldn't you transplant them over there? I just transplanted two for my garden out high. I don't know how good they're going to do. Because a lot of times when you transplant a sunflower, it dies. Really? Yeah. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah, I tried it before. But it looks like it's getting wet in that. Get, did Coco go back out with you? Oh. The dogs want to be Not outside. Dog. No, I, I thought he went out. Let me get some breakfast going here, you guys. So today we're getting some housework done and then we're going to go off and uh, go to Harrow and get some chicken feed and I'm hoping that thrift store is open in Harrow. I don't know if it will be or not but I'm hoping. I'm in the mood and uh, we gotta get some bread. A couple things. I love shopping. <laughs> okay this is called a use it up breakfast. We had two toast ends that needed to be used up five pieces of bacon and a half uh, one muffin was left so i cut it in half use it up breakfast <laughs> i'm right here i'm right here i'm cleaning up daddy's mess when he spilled the salt two days ago and then cleaning it up yeah i'm right here i didn't go anywhere okay I'll bring you in here. Daddy says you always get your way. And I said, yes, of course. When you're a senior citizen, you get your own way. And they said, he, she, he's 84. Leave him alone. He's the same age as my mom. Okay, you guys, we got lettuce to process here. And I've got waffles going for Nate. And then we got to get out the door soon to get to the feed store. Yeah. Oh, I got a lot cleaned, you guys. A ton of cleaning done. I love to have it all clean on Friday so we don't have to do it all weekend long. You know what I mean? Jelly bean. Yeah. Oh, these smell good. I haven't had a waffle in a long time. Maybe we'll have one for lunch. Yeah, we got to um, prep dinner too. We're going to have tuna melts for dinner and salad. Doesn't that sound good? Yeah. Summertime eating, you guys. I like to get every square in the waffle. <laughs> there. 
Nate, your waffles are up. <laughs> oh, you guys weren't even watching me. Silly guys. Jeez. Just step out and get green onions. Aren't they beautiful? <laughs> right from our yard. I love it. Oh, I love, love growing in the yard. Wow, lots of people. That's a big crowd there. Ooh, blurry. <laughs> I guess we can socialize with 10 people now, eh? Okay, let's mix those green things up. <laughs> and then I like to put salt, pepper, garlic, onion powder, and he want. Whatever spices you want, I throw salt, pepper, and garlic in it, and onion powder. Then we do the mayo. I don't measure. I don't like a dry tuna. <laughs> yeah, so I just do a little bit at a time and mix it. I like to mix it with a fork, actually, because that way we can really mix the tuna well. I'm going to go get a fork and mix this up. Okay, so I'm just going to leave it in that bowl because we're going to be putting it on this for our dinner. But that will be later on uh, after we come back from doing a little shopping. Okay, letting this soak with ice water. We're going to spin this out and put it in the bag. And it'll be ready for uh, dinner. Or when we want to grab a salad, we'll just grab a handful of lettuce out of the bag. Homegrown sweetness. Yeah. I love... This is one thing I do love about summertime. Is homegrown. And you can't wait for the tomatoes to come. Oh boy. Yeah. The trick is to spin, spin, spin. Get all that water out of your lettuce. Yes. Spin, spin, spin. There we go. We have lettuce prepped. And I'm just going to stick this paper towel in there just to absorb the moisture. You don't need to buy those bag salads when you grow your own. Look at that. Yum. I'm going to prep these up. I'll show you how I wash them up. What I do is I take my salad spinner here and I throw them all in there. I don't spin them, but I soak them in water. And I leave the stems on. When you wash strawberries, you should leave the stems on. Yes, for sure. And then I fill this up with water and leave them soak for a little bit. And then I'll show you what you can do. Fill it up with water, let them soak, and then you have them in here. So, oh, I got a bad strawberry there. You can uh, take them out like this and rinse them off. Easy. Do not cut the stem off, though, until you, you use them. I think I might have one of those Twinkies. I had to, couldn't think of the name for some darn reason. When you come to me, I'm going to put a little sugar on top, mix it up, and that'll bring the juices right out. We will get out the door, you guys. We will. I promise we will. <laughs> okay, I'm going to get these in the fridge. I'm going to wipe down the bathroom, and then we're going to head out the door. I think we're just going to go to Walmart. We're not going to go to the feed store. We'll go there tomorrow with Bruce. I'm trying. I'm, I'm like, Michelle, you run all over and then you'll tire yourself out. So Walmart's good enough for today. Yeah. Okay, guys. All done at Walmart. Now we're going to go to Shopper's Drug. It says I have uh, something in my P.O. box. And we're going to get some different flavor of pops. Let's go guys. Girls, come on. <laughs> girls, come on. Come on girls. 
here they come. <laughs> There's my girls. <laughs> Louise is always slow. She'll come around. She's slow. Hi, girls! What's she doing? What's my my girls doing? What do you got? Sandy! Wait! G give me that! Give me that! Hey! You're stealing! From the recycling box! She's stealing, you guys! Have fun! Okay, guys. Let me show you what we got. I got a box of Cheerios for Nate. I got uh, cheesy blasted taco shells. I got peach. I thought I was getting apple juice for Nate. Peach juice. I got two of them. I got plastic forks. We never have enough. When those packages are mixed, we ne always never have enough forks. I hope these are sturdy. I got bread for me and Bruce. Bread for Nate. And I got tortillas. I got these cups. I thought they'd be nice to bring your pop outside. They change colors when when there's dice in them. And then they got a lid so the bugs can't get in your pop. I got this ice cream scooper. I thought it was cute. I got some creamy Havarti. Two packages of old cheddar. Uh, chip dip. We're having, uh, I'm getting my hair cut on Sunday. Bruce's friend's coming over with his wife. And she's going to cut my hair. We're going to have a barbecue. I got peanut butter cups. Uh, Kit Kats. Snickers. And Mars bars. I got a pack of frozen hamburgers for the barbecue. Cheesy beef burgers. Nate wanted some more Eggos. They had the goldfish on sale, so I got three. I got some croutons for my salad, and I got chips for our barbecue, barbecue, whey, cheddar, and sour cream, dill pickle, and Doritos. Then I got some cookies for the babies, milk bones, and then soft and chewy, uh, what is that, steak and cheese, and filet mignon. I got... Two cases of pop, Diet Zero and Orange Crush. Pop was really very little. They didn't have a lot at both stars I went to. Okay, I got this for my stockpile. The Walmart had the Lysol wipes and then I got these at Chopper's Drug. I like, I know I can get bigger hand sanitizers, but I like the little ones. And these are hand wipe sanitizers. And uh, that will go in my stockpile. I got some cleaning supplies. I got scrubbing bubbles for the toilet and for the shower. I got a Swifter thing for my floor. Ne uh, Bruce needed a new faucet for his hose. I got two magazines. Cooking magazines. I needed batteries for a smoke alarm because it was beeping and Sandy's upset. I needed a white top to wear under my dress I'm wearing. I like to have a little white top under it. And I got myself two pairs of shorts. And that's what we got at Walmart and Shoppers Drug. Hey guys, let's put all this away and then we'll, ha we'll make our dinner. Okay, my stock box is getting full. We got full. the stock box. We got, we got everything. You want some hand sanitizer? You want some of those masks? <laughs> those disinfected wipes? You want a police mask? I mean, a mask? I don't know. It's okay, a, yeah, we got. I got two, this four, thing looks awesome, though. five. Uh, I'll just keep adding to it. Back up! Back up! Go now! Here. Six feet! <laughs> got the. Got the <laughs> You're making getting a there. collection, Mom. You I'm don't making need a stockpile. Oh, and I can't forget these to throw in there. Oh, yeah. These are 99.9 .9 good. I'll buy the good stuff. Mom, 99.9. That's .9, not 100%. Oh, come on. What? Percent, 1%. You should have bought the 100 ones. <laughs> I haven't seen 100 I ones. Actually, truth be told, they're not. They probably don't exist. Yeah. Okay, you guys. Let's make our tuna melts. 
So I got my naan bread here. My garlic naan bread. Ooh, it smells good. Yeah. And I have my tuna that we made earlier. You're just going to spread your tuna on the naan bread. And spread it out. And then we're going to just melt cheese on top. Put it in the oven. 